Tonight, at least 78 people are dead and dozens still missing after raging floodwaters pummeled Brazil's streets on Tuesday. Water seen rushing down the mountainous region, with many victims still believed to be buried. Residents and rescue teams carrying body bags through the rubble. And here, a mother desperately searching for her child. Verified social media video shows entire houses and even cars dragged away by mudslides. Officials say the flooding began in the evening, over 10 inches of rain in just three hours. That's almost as much rain as the last 30 days in the area combined. But this week, local residents looked on as water swirled through the city of Petropolis, a mountainous region of Rio de Janeiro. In some cases, houses were buried entirely beneath mud. Brazilian President Jair Bolsonaro tweeted on Tuesday in part that he would be initiating immediate assistance to the victims as the death toll continues to rise. Rio's governor says at least 44 localities have been affected. It's not the first time this area has been slammed by a deluge. In January 2011, heavy rainfall caused more than 900 deaths. Now, Governor Claudio Castro says the government will dig out the buried area with machinery. He adds that at least 400 soldiers have joined the rescue operation, racing to find survivors. As the city of Petropolis begins what City Hall has declared, three days of mourning. Muito triste mesmo, muito triste. Muito triste. A nossa cidade simplesmente acabou. O nosso bairro acabou. Zinclay Asamoa, NBC News. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.